Hello there, this is Base Number 5. Welcome back to our Golden Horde Let's Play series, where we're currently at war with a big chunk of India, if you look at this. Delphi, Bengal, and Bahamanis, and little Gujarat over here. Who has is allocating zero troops to this war, but, you know, they're here. Their name is on the truce. Uh, new business opportunity is fine. You guys are suffering a ton of attrition here. I'm totally okay with the fact that they are going to be um, winning this siege. It's not the biggest deal for us since they are suffering 2.5% attrition. Oh, look at that. 5,000 troops just gone. Oof. Got the reinforcement tick. <clears throat> just watching their manpower just dwindle. Goes another. Well, after the reinforcement, it was still 400 troops. No, we're not doing that. We are suffering attrition 1.2 and. 1.4% attrition in, in our own stuff. Oh, you guys took it the 29th, so you guys got a morale tick. That sucks. How's that manpower looking, though, after that? Bengal has no manpower. Delphi has 6,000. Bahamas actually came out of that pretty unscathed. To be honest, you guys come south over here. We can go fight some, some Bahamas troops. And some Bengali. Bengalese, however you want to say it. You guys go and sit in the mountains. You guys be safe there. That's Highlands, we're not interested in that. We are either going to be sitting in very defensive terrain for us, or fighting in terrain that is good for us. One or the other. Really, you're gonna, you're gonna do that to us? Go fight in the desert, I don't mind. <clears throat> there goes a little 1k stack. Bloop. Go say out of the rest of the army. That is Drylands, good combat train for us. Did go ahead and delete that fort previously. That's may have been a little bit of a mistake. <clears throat> go and wait for you guys to be locked in, and now we're just gonna come north <clears throat> with the rest of the army. That is Bengal sieging. Again losing well they they're out of manpower actually. You guys are all gonna leave. We'll just go in here. This is the this is the siege stack. It's not the best stack to be actually fighting with. Everyone is supposed to be attached to this army though, so there's drylands. We do have combat bonuses here. Uh, okay, you guys are already going north. <clears throat> that army is too big now. Killed 10,000 troops though, lost 7k. You know, does play a difference, or make a difference. End of the Peasant War in uh, Burgundy. Oh, let's not fight there, that's mountains. Are you leaving? Oh, you're actually, got, you guys are moving in. Go that way. Oh, our heir is tragically, oh, he's a 112, he's garbage. Make the heir a leader, he's also garbage. Yeah, he's awful. At least we know which one is the siege stack now, dang. That's Drylands. We'll go fight Gudrat's army there. Go ahead. Allocate all of the army. That's a 71% at our... What day will we, will you get there? You get there on the 8th. So you guys do get reinforced. It is what it is. Brilliant. Get a little bit of mysticism going on. You guys go there. Afghanistan, you're not feeling that well. Let's go over. Reseed your capital. Bahamanas, you're in the south. <clears throat> That's kind of how these wars go. We kind of just... We have to let them in our land in order for us to actually really be able to pick them apart. Well, that was a very quick siege. Let's go over here. Uh, that, that's mountains. Let's not cross the mountains yet. Let's go say hi over here to the desert. You guys go here. That is mountains. Are you locked in? No. Let's go there. That's also mountains. I don't, I don't want to fight in the mountains, guys. You guys are locked in on those mountains. That sucks. I guess we'll do two fights in the mountains just so you guys can't reinforce. At the very least. You guys get out. Ended up winning that fight. 
You guys still coming in? Reinforce? No, you guys left. Go help that army. Ship consolidate. Don't get stack wiped. Okay. Good. So each stack you go over there. You have no morale. Alright, you have morale now though. Go there. How about stack? You'll be there the fifth. You'll be there late. <clears throat> Just go in then a little bit. <clears throat> Bengal is on medium enthusiasm already. I'd say that's a pretty good success. You guys take the long way around, get some reinforcement going. That is mountains. Stop trying to go in on, on the mountains, my dudes. Mountains is not terrain for us. You decided to insult us? Oh, there goes Bengal's army. There we go. It's gone. That actually was not that big as decisive as what I was kind of hoping it would be. Like, it was very marginally... It was a marginal fight. You guys are going over there. That's fine. You guys are doing a little bit of covered sieging in the north. That's okay as well. It's just going to drive a war exhaustion up. I don't care that much. That's mountains. We're not interested in fighting there. They would be there. The 11th, uh, seven days later. We are not interested in that. You guys go ahead and go around. Still waiting on that military tech. It's gonna make a big difference once we have that. We're up to 40%. Oof, increase. That's desert. We can actually fight there. Hi, Delphi. Wow, we were rolling absolute like garbage. Yeah, absolute garbage rolls. You guys go home. And you're going all the way home. Dang, guys. You don't need to go that far. Manpower is gone. Lost 32,000 there. Oof. Let's go and get all of our manpower back, though. Very easy for us to do. Delphi is out of manpower, Bengal is out of manpower, Bahamana is actually doing just fine. Siege is over. Oh, okay, that's in Oman, it's not ours. This is the siege stack. So you guys just kind of leave. Combat stack needs to reinforce. <clears throat> and you guys are just carpet sieging right now, which is very annoying. Stay there. Kandar, yeah. You guys are just going for full occupation right now. Kish. Bunch of forts that we'll have to get back later. Actually, your probably main reason for staying in right now is... Yeah, Alliance War Score, plus 16. If that wasn't there, wouldn't be that big of an issue. But you have the ticking war goal at the moment with... Minus 17 from battles, because apparently we can't fight crap right now. Say hi to Delhi's army. Oh, they're able to avoid it. That's desert. We can go fight there. <clears throat> Hopefully we're at the point where we've finally like broken their armies at least a little bit. Uh, why are you throwing your army away? There you go. 4% war score. Still, we're not doing like massive damage. Kind of what I'm used to. Uh, why don't you go ahead and send the five artillery into this army? Make the combat stack as strong as possible. Might as well. Our two annexations are actually almost already over. That was very quick. You guys are sitting in the mountains. All right, we go north. <clears throat> Still at negative 17 reasons. Your army continues to weaken. You guys are going in there. Should consolidate real quick. Uh, probably going to lose our tactics advantage here. Or, yeah, because our manpower is super low. 
checked it. Wow, we rolled a, a zero, though. Is that prestige? Why? You guys' tactics is better than us. Your morale is better than us. Let's get out of there. Guys, just go north. You go ahead and state all of this region, at least. We can do that. Bengal, yeah, you guys are just getting happier and happier with this. Move towards legalism, yep. Guys, all go north. It's very frustrating. Bengal needs to get out. You guys are just carpet sieging. At least have the manpower, basically, to fully reinforce for the most part. You are just infantry. You are nothing special. It is attached to the uh, combat stack, at the very least. Sure, check it out. You can have military access. You guys are coming for the combat stack. All right. Well, we're just gonna go ahead and raise this province. Or scorch earth it. I always forget where that button is. Something we definitely need to do here, though. Button, where are you? I want to burn it. I want to scorch earth it. I need to have an army here. Go. Yeah. Siege view, no. Why do I not see you? I've definitely clicked you before. <laughs> Why can I not find this button? I don't know. That's to, I don't want to raise that. I want to scorch the earth. Where are you, Button? Recent uprising, no. Oh, Dot's here. Scorcher. Yeah, do it. Just still get caught. What day? 20th? 20th. You need more maneuver. 20th. 20th. Take this guy. 19th. 20th. There you go. Yeah, oh, well, you guys are dead. Just disband that. You guys come south. You guys are going north. Take the maneuver leader. Take anyone else. I guess this 4-2 will do. Not that we definitely need that. So this is kind of one of those things where we definitely bit off a lot more than what we could probably chew. To be honest. Delhi, you really still don't have much of an army. Go north. Alright, fine, go north. That's steps we can fight you there. And we can reinforce in. You have a 3 5. What is this? You guys have really good leaders. You'll be the 10th, be the 11th. Perfect. Uh, it will indeed go away someday. At least that's the presumption. Let's see, we are losing negative 16 from battles. Again, not really that good of a fight. Did you get military tech? 14 to 14, we're equal playing field. Okay. We were the 2 4. Hmm. Taking a loan, not a big deal. We'll take many loans over the course of this battle, probably. Bengal, still getting a little bit closer. What are you what are you asking for? Uh nah. Really? That's only 16 Diplo points for all that land? Don't think so. 7,000 manpower in debt. We'll go ahead and lose our professionalism once more for additional 25,000. 
go on Gujarat's army this time. Uh, we're going to extend loan. Do something like that. Be there eighth. Be there like a week later. What is our tactics doing? Because our cab advantage is garbage. Just yeah. Get out of there. It's not even a fight worth having. Just absolutely no infantry in that army apparently. Slinch. Uh yeah, just take this AK, go there. Having that tactics disadvantage hurts a lot. Take the 4 2. There we go. We're going south. We need to go hunting. Master Minch. Let's go for national unrest. We kind of need that right now. Going in there. That'll be okay. Uh, yeah, we'll take the military power. You're, we're still waiting on tech. There we go. Gives the tactics advantage. I don't care about the infantry. Just tactics. You guys are going south. You need to go start reoccupying our land. Now Grod's losing his army. Not a big deal, though. Vassals are starting to actually cost us horse score now at this point. Did manage to go ahead and reinforce that fight. What is it? Okay, it's like, what is this garbage? And that's another fight lost. And which is going to compound. Alrighty, this war is lost. Where's Vassal, Vassalage of Delphi as part of their offer? Oh, that's fine. Let's suggest. See two provinces. At least Moldavia, no thank you. I'd rather give it land. Where's Kabul? Okay. Where's Ghazni? Sure. Man's other things other than gold. I don't even know why you let us give up gold then. You know. Uh, Fars can be released. Alright, let's keep that. We're just gonna release tributary or cancel tributaries for us. It's fine. Not gonna release anything. Sure. No real difference. Just wow, that was awful. It should have been a like almost a slam dunk and just no. <laughs> what did that just prove our army is absolute garbage actually? Oof. Yeah, give us that horde unity we need at the moment. Did lose one core. You go ahead and become a tributary again. That's why I don't really mind giving up these tributaries. It doesn't really make that big of a difference in our life. In our life. Actually, you don't want to be a tributary. Maybe we just eat you then. Now that we can really afford it at the moment, dang. That was brutal. That was almost our back getting broken. Move towards legalism, that's fine. 
Like, Poland was easier fight than what it was just there with Delphi. Oof. Bohemia. You're still doing fine. What is the current combat width? Just so we can make, like, the perfect fighting stack. It is 29. Stop attaching. Did not mean to click the boat. Greedy unit. If it's only 29. 16. Probably take a little extra cav. Take the artillery. There you go, that's a combat stack. Go over there. You and you need to merge. You can make the siege stack. Do you need additional like allies at this point? You do have two. Let's see, who hates the Ming? The Ottomans, okay. Who hates the Polish? Hungary does. Hungary doesn't like me though. Bohemia? You could probably be persuaded, yep. Okay. Who hates the Jam? The Karakanulu does not like me. Let's see. Hormuz, we're not friendly with friends with you. Chagatai just kind of is what it is. You at least like us. Ah, actually, don't take the infantry. I'd much rather have artillery in these armies. Up to 10. Pick up 5. We're out of manpower, but that's fine. Might as well actually get like combat worthy stacks, even if it costs us just a crap ton of money. We'll live on the backs of everyone else. Go and summon a diet. What do we get? How easy is it? Manpower at least 50%. Well, that's gonna fail. We already know that. You guys go and take a sage siege leader. Actually, you're the combat stack. You take the siege leader. You take the combat leader. And I guess we're gonna go towards Poland, because, you know, if we just lost a war, what's a better way to get back and swing back into things? And that's with uh, fighting some more. And these ones, we actually have land already over here. That is. It's okay terrain, it's not the best. Not the worst, definitely don't need these boats anymore. They're kind of useless to us at this point. Let's see. Improve relations, ooh, yay. It's kind of sarcasm, but. Production, nothing. Taxes, nothing. Alright. Lithuania! We were to hypothetically go to war here. Bohemia. Not so inclined to not fight. Guys have a lot of, lot of artillery at this point. Bohemia is going to join, even though they are a friend. Honestly, who hates Poland? How are you a rival of, of Poland? Opel, explain that one to me. Jam, Hungary, yeah, no one's, no one's going to help us. Alright, Lithuania it is. Show superiority. Same same con or same military tech, so not the big of a big of a deal. Go ahead and start invading. Agenda failed, not a big deal. Manpower is gonna be low for at least the beginning of this war. It'll recover eventually over time. Occupying land, Navgrad, that's all woods I'm not really interested in. 100% honest. We need all of you guys to come to the south so we can deal fatal blows to you guys from there. Not so much over here in the north. Poland, I have no idea where your army is at this point. Guys, are we in a battle somewhere that I'm not seeing? That's what it kind of looks like. Going over there, we are 2,000 manpower in Dutch. Not really that concerned about it. So it must have been like fighting rebels or something. I will go towards legalism, obviously. Uh, that's farmland. We'll go say hi to your army over there, Lithuania. 
That is Polish. Actually, that's Bohemian troops. Let's go say hi to you guys over there. Everyone's happier with us. Very nice. Yeah, we're just not really packing nearly as much of a punch as what we used to. There went 2,000 troops. Bohemia just gets shattered. I actually lost 10,000 troops there. I guess we can go ahead and start looting this region. Goods produced can be reduced. Not a big deal. Let's go say hi to Denmark's army. Winning order just obliterated. Goes another 4,000. Lithuania's coming on down here. Still our combat stack, so. Grassland, that's farmland. Go after Lithuania, see if we can compound it a little bit. Just break them real quick. Denmark's gonna be very hard to get out, so. Not kill that many, actually. Frontline, yeah, we've lost all of our infantry, that's kind of a, a big deal. Truce with you guys. That's Highlands. Let's go up to this Farmlands. This is the Siege stack. Extra Diplo points and Prestige. We'll take it. <clears throat> Let's go and get our land back. You guys go ahead and occupy over here. Novgorod, you're actually in a decent state, I would say. You have too much calves still. Pretty close. You know, you got 20% calf. Probably right on the bubble. It's grassland, we're not gonna go fight there. We'll take this back. Not that we don't have any forts here. Take Warsaw, come on back over here and bring both armies together. We can fight together. You guys are resieging your land back. That's a okay with me. Gives that Diplo rep. It'll be useful. Novgorod, I just kinda need you to go siege your own land back here in Denmark. Let's go take this back. Sure, you guys can have that. Let's go and see the manpower of our enemies. We are out of manpower. Bohemia is out of manpower, though. Poland's already pretty close. Lithuania, they can actually fully restock their army at least once. We, however, cannot. We are 9,000 in debt. Let me actually go ahead and just click this button one more time. Say goodbye to that professionalism, but we're doing okay. Uh, we'll take the army tradition. It'd be very useful for us. All right, let's go say hi to Poland's army. 14k here, or actually there, that'll be fine. Kind of looks like their army is running away. Kind of being a little cowardly there, Poland. There went another 8,000. Oh, you guys are also down here. Go say hi down here. Again, we've lost all of our infantry. I know the infantry take the front line the most, but... It's almost getting to a point of, uh, it's stupid how, how quickly our infantry die. You guys, come on down. Why is your ta guys' tactics so much better than ours? Just discipline. Yeah, just discipline. Do we have a discipline guy? Ah, we do. He is expensive though. But, I think he'll end up paying for himself with our lies. Artillery combat bonus on this guy. Do have not enough infantry. Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and create a new unit. One, two, send three cav north. A new unit. One, two, three infantry south. Now we'll just do a little bit of a rebalance. Because right now it is not going well. <clears throat> Alright, you guys come over here towards Lithuania. I need you to actually go siege some forts. I think that one will do. Or just go over here to Bohemia. Military leader has left us. That was our combat leader. It's not good. You guys go and stop right here. Stop in for a moment, and pick up a new leader. 
Five two three is decent. A uh, one six two is much better, since we do most of our damage is shock. There we go. Extra three shock. A negative one penalty is not that bad. Oh, there went a Polish arm. Oh, that was a Bohemian army that just got shattered. Lithuania. Again, you're still pretty much on par with our army for losses in terms. Go over here to Poland. You can say how howdy real quick. Let's see, again, this is mostly a siege leader, but well. They're doing better than the calf stack is actually, so let's go after the capital of Bohemia. And we could probably just piece them out. Ah, not quite that easy. They're inclined to say no. That is alone. Oh well. You guys are doing stuff in the north. Again, let's come on back over here to Poland. Because we get them down to the low, we can probably do something about it. Do you have multiple wars, uh, Bohemia? There you go. Nope, just the one. Okay. Just gonna be walking on through. That's a 29k stack. We'll be outmanned. Bohemia, how inclined are you for peace? You are ready. Then I shall set you free. It does mean this Polish stack now is outnumbered, which means we can actually go in on it. Wow, they have a lot more reinforcements, and our tactics is probably gone. No, our tactics still are okay. But get out of there. Lost about equal troops, honestly. Go surprise the, uh, the Lithuanians over here. Take the 5-2-3 for a minute. Guys, black flagged, unblack flagged, on the capital. They don't know we were there, because, well, we were black flagged. Denmark, you're doing stuff over here. Being announced as the rival again. Sure. Seems like infantry is actually at the point where it's doing more damage than Cav. You guys fled? You guys, how dare you guys flee the field of battle? Why are you guys still on high enthusiasm? Polish military strength apparently is high. Well, the strength of the alliance. Yeah, you you definitely have a stronger alliance. That's mostly due to Denmark. Doing his thing. We have more manpower at this point. Poland still has a little bit, but again, it's mostly mercs at this point. Lithuania has been eroded, and Livonian order has also eroded. Good. That's what we want to see. Go say hi over to Lithuania's army once more. And should be easily taken care of, to be honest. Extra taxes, missionary strength, that's fine. You guys actually lived. Yeah, you, like, these little 4k stacks are not supposed to be living. To consolidate. Is this why? There you go, it's gone. This is woods, we're not interested in fight fighting or defending in the woods. Looks like we're gonna have to, though. That is a 6 cav stack. Ah, that would have preferred to have caught out. Alright. So go ahead and win against the Danish, good. Steps, that's fine to be in. It's a victory there. Sure, Burgundy, you can have military access. I don't know why you need it. We're on low enthusiasm now. Is there another vassal that we can spit out of you, though? Oh, well, Morazio is a thing. So is the Teutons. Poland. Do something like that. And we can feed the vassal. Do you need to make sure we keep Warsaw? Really, you're going in on my army. Ship consolidate. Let's go ahead and run across. You guys keep tempting it. I don't know why you guys think you can fight this army. Oh, that's Denmark's army. Don't actually want to cross that one. We are 
coming to the relief of Warsaw. You guys go in and you guys follow. Bring in the artillery in the back. This army is getting shattered. Reinforcements made a big difference. They lost 12,000 to... well, we also lost 12,000. Pretty equal in terms. Let's go there. There. Let's go relief. Uh, no, we're not going to go relief that fort. Lithuania is on low. Poland's still on low. Or on medium. We're trying to get that tick over. Yep, you guys took that fort back. That's fine. It happens. Take this siege. Go after the Livonian order. And move over there. But that is all the time I have for today. If you enjoyed today's episode, please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful